been a little bit of controversy stirring up in the MLB, and I thought I'd just jump on the story real quick before clock hits midnight and the story pumpkins out and everybody forgets about it by tomorrow. Kevin Brown, a commenter for the Orioles, has been removed from the press box and been suspended for uh, indefinitely, I guess, at this point, because, man, what a hearsay. What a terrible human being. Um, but there are times where... Yes, there are plenty of idiots out there that say stupid things on a hot mic. And, like, there are some images that sports fans, they can just hear the image by just looking at it. Honestly, like, just leave it to the MLB to, once they get things going well, like, their ratings are starting to go up after the brawl, but then also with Boone mocking the umpire, the Red Sox hitting a grand slam walk-off, you know, and all these teams that are kind of making a playoff push, Baltimore coming out of nowhere and being number one, they take one step forward and then two steps back with stupid bonehead stuff like this. And honestly, I agree with a lot of what other people have been saying where they just throw so much shade at how soft, like how soft can the MLB truly be? All he was doing was stating facts. That'd be as if, gosh, it reminded me... Um, when Chris Collinsworth, no, 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 it wasn't Chris Collinsworth. It was Kirk Herbstreit and Al Michaels when they were calling the Colts game. And then they called the uh, Colts and Broncos game. And then the, a few weeks later, they called the Arizona versus Saints game when they're like, guys, please come back. We know there will be touchdowns, you know, have the same kind of energy. It's like they were just stating the fact of like, hey, there have been zero touchdowns and terrible performances in the games that we have called, you know, Please come back. Next game should be a high scoring one. And sure enough, it was. It just, it shows just how soft and fragile, like, stating facts can be in the MLB. And if anything, that's something to be happy about with how, you know, their record of, hey, we're finally doing decent. We're beating a team that's been beating us up lately. And then they get suspended for it. If anything, I agree of what, you know, John Boy Media's team is saying where it's like, Everybody in the van that was making the graphics, the intern that's barely paid enough to pay rent, who, you know, typed up that graphic an hour before going into commercial break, um, the producer, the director, everybody in that squad should be suspended just the same. Not just Brown. Like, don't just single him out. Like, single everybody out that made the graphic. That's just how I feel about that. Truthfully, like, behind closed doors, if the dude's a total jack wagon, you know, that's yet to be determined but for just bashing on a team saying hey we've been pretty bad but now we're doing good come on come on just wait because once the nfl rolls around and we're in week four or five you know people are already clowning on the cardinals for being terrible and even in the mlb people have been clowning on the athletics the royals the tigers all season nobody from them's been suspended come on clean it up